Hello world, it's Random Vandom. If you like watching Random Vandom videos, please like and subscribe. This YouTube video is a watch at your own risk YouTube video. It is not meant for intended to be as legal, financial, or medical advice or mental health advice. So I've been thinking about this one for a while. I've had to do it for a while and, and there's probably been a little bit of a lag between my last video and this one. And I don't want to blame that on the medication. I just, I want to say that life's been pretty busy and so there's been times with that. So I've kind of gotten up to what I think might be my target dose of this medication. I mean, it's not exactly where it's going to be, but right now we're right about 10 milligrams of the quick release in the morning and then taking a one of these slow release, which is a 10 milligram over eight hours at noon. And typically I take about a five milligram around five o'clock. This can vary a little bit. Sometimes I might take two milligrams throughout the day just to give me a little bit more kick. And sometimes I might take a little bit more here and there, but that's pretty much gotten to be the dose. Now there was a few days ago when I was working pretty hard and I felt like I was a little bit dizzy. So I've noticed that. And then um, one especially day that I was doing this work, kind of building this, um, this cover portable garage thing for my RV. And I was going up and down a lot and I came up too fast once and I just got too dizzy. That could have happened with or without the medication, but I did notice it. And so I actually skipped the day. I took a medication vacation as I've heard, uh, with the medication. So I skipped the day and got back on it the next day, and, and that was okay, but I did not like that dizzy feeling I had that one day. I don't know if it was directly related to the medication or not. Uh, as far as my task going, I think that I actually have been able to get a lot more tasks done. If you've been watching this channel and some of my other channels, you would notice that I have been able to get more videos out. I've been really kind of concentrating on getting my project debt down, but that necessarily hasn't been too easy. Project debt meaning that my brain will keep on saying, well, you should do this, you should do that, you should make a video of this, you should make a video of that. And I'll tend to pile up a lot of unfinished videos and unfinished projects on my phone. And that's still been happening a lot. Um, so there's definitely still that. A lot been going on at work and those types of things. I do feel like I feel happier or better on this medication. And it's kind of hard to tell that because, you know, the medication came the same time as a new job. So, you know, it could be the new job or whatever, but that's definitely a different thing. So all of this is going on. And this, like I said before, is a journal of my experience with methylphenidate. And so if you are curious about that then you can keep on watching again this is for entertainment purposes only and i'm not recommending any drugs to anybody but i'm just keeping a journal for myself and for anybody who wants to listen so if you're finding this interesting you know subscribe to the channel and look for the other videos on this subject about methylphenidate or adhd that type of stuff